Hello lovely people and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a review slash lip swatch slash my views on this product over here. It is Stena Lip Paint from Fenty Beauty by Rihanna in the shade Uncuffed. So if you're curious to find out my views then please keep on watching. Okay, so let's get started and the first thing that we're going to do is read some key information about this product from the website. So in UK, Fenty Beauty can be purchased from Harvey Nichols. Um, the shade Uncuffed, that the one I have purchased, is a rosy mauve. Um, I'll insert a lip swatch video of this shade in uh, a little bit later on, but it's the same shade that I have on my lips right now. I'm not sure how rosy it is <laughs> because it's definitely darker to what I'm used to. Um, I'll just read a few key bits from the website and then um, we'll get on to the lip swatch and my views on this. So they say a weightless 12 hour liquid lipstick with a soft matte finish born in a range of head turning shades that look incredible on all skin tones. Um, they say when life's all about taking risks, wearing liquid lipstick shouldn't be one of them. Um, enter Stena Lip Paint, the love child of high impact color and low maintenance long wear. Um, now in a range of head turning shades. Okay guys, so on the website there's like a lot more information about this lipstick. Um, I'm gonna leave it for now. Um, I'll just start getting into a few key bits uh, of information about this and then I'll carry on with a uh, lip swatch as well as my views on it. Okay guys, let's get into the packaging and all. So this is how the lipstick is packaged. Um, it retails for 19 pounds and the quantity is 4 ml. I think that's a really good price point because uh, Fenty Beauty is a luxury brand and I think they are being very competitive by you know only charging 19 pounds for a liquid lipstick whereas all other brands are probably charging way more. I think it's kind of the same range as maybe MAC lipsticks. So if you open it up, you know, you, you see this and then you can just pull it out and oops. And here is how the lipstick looks. Or the shade uh, Uncuffed, the one that I purchased. Um, I'm going to now insert a clip of me applying this lipstick and then we'll get on to my views. So um, this is how the lipstick looks on me. Now I do believe that the shade looks darker than on my lips than it does in the bottle. Um, in in the in the in the bottle, it really looks like it's more of a rosy and less of a mauve. But on my lips, it really looks like more mauve and less rosy. Um, Definitely this shade is a bit darker to what I'm actually used to or what I'm actually comfortable wearing. Uh, but on the other hand, what the first thing that I've noticed about this liquid lipstick is how good its applicator is. Now, it's got a weird shape to it. And I don't know if that's the reason that this applicator is so easy to use and so smooth to use. I know Charlotte Tilbury, when she launched her liquid lipsticks a couple of years ago, she had a weird applicator as well, but that applicator was actually difficult to use. But this one, it's so easy to use and it's so smooth. Now, Stena Lip Paint, they're not new. They've been out, you know, for quite some time, but actually this is the first one that I purchased. Um, and I have really liked them. I've really liked how easy it's been to apply. So I've tried it out on a few days now. Um, they claim that this lipstick lasts for up to 12 hours. Um, with me, you know, full day off, being at work, having tea, coffee, snacks, 
I think it lasted maybe for like six to seven hours. But what I would say is that it wasn't leaving marks on my teacup like other lipsticks do. So um, does it last up to 12 hours? No, it does not. But does it last like a good amount of six, seven hours without any retouch? Yeah, it definitely does. And that's, you know, with a full day off, not worrying about anything and just carrying on with your day as normal. Um, would I recommend this product? Definitely I would. I think the shade range is very bold. Um, they have like a bright red, they have a bright pink, they have a bright orange, they have black. So it's... It's a shade range for somebody who wants to experiment, but this is definitely one of the best liquid lipsticks out there. I am so impressed with how comfortable it is, and I'm so impressed with how creamy the formula is, and definitely the applicator is the best that's out there at the moment. So yeah, definitely go for it. Would I be repurchasing a different shade? Yes, I would be. Now, <laughs> although the shade range is out of my comfort zone, I think there's no harm in being different sometimes and just trying out different colors. So I'm planning to purchase one of their bright pink shades. I'm not sure exactly what it's called, but I'll definitely be doing a lip swatch of that one as well. So uh, does this get a yes from me? Definite yes. I think it's, it's a brilliant product. The way it's been packaged, the way the applicator works and the formula, I think it's all amazing job well done to Rihanna for investing so heavily in her beauty beauty line so as far as I'm concerned it's a yes from me so guys I think that's it for this video I believe I've covered everything that I wanted to say um, if you have any questions or any views that you would like to share then please do leave them in the comment section down below and until next time please keep smiling